Our next candidate is um, Kalen Fretz, also a candidate for U.S. House District 1 from, he's a Libertarian. Well, hello, thank you for having me here tonight. I'm Kalen Fretz, and I want to be your congressman. My mission is simple, to restore the Constitution. I'm a Christian, a Virginia Tech uh, graduate in computer science, entrepreneur, <laughs> go Hogies, and a uh, business owner for many years now. I also just got married two months ago, so this is a, a big year for me. Uh, what about the incumbent, my opponent, Jeff Miller? He's promoting an agenda that hurts all of us, all of you. He talks like a conservative, but he's voted for well over $5 trillion in new debt since he's come into office. $2 trillion of that uh, this past year alone, more than $2 trillion. That's tens of thousands in new debt for every family in this room. And it's already diminishing your quality of life in the American way. Now, why haven't we heard the voice of reason on the unjust income tax as it is right now? Let's repeal and replace that with a fair tax. We also must pass a balanced budget amendment. And we must prosecute foreclosure fraud and crimes going all the way from Wall Street to the Federal Reserve. Our congressman likes to portray himself as a defender of veterans, but I sincerely ask the veterans in this audience, how many of you fought for more debt, less freedoms, and endless war? Our number one national security threat is a tanking economy as we borrow 43, 43 cents of every dollar from countries like China. And Jeff Miller has been right there to, to sign the check every time. He also believes your sacred national, natural rights are bargaining chips. Just look what he's voted for. To protect big pharma from lawsuits even if they harm you. To allow President Obama to lock up American citizens without due process. To allow the TSA to look at any, there we go, to look at and even touch your naked body as a condition of travel. To allow the government to invade your privacy inside your home. <laughs> Sorry for the mic. He voted for Planned Parenthood funding. He voted for doubling the size of the failed Federal Department of Education. For this he gets an F. Here's what it comes down to. You will never benefit from being bribed with your own tax dollars. You will never be protected by sacrificing your liberties. And you will never be served by giving more power to politicians and bureaucrats in D.C. Yet that's exactly what Jeff Miller wants you to believe. Don't take my word for it. Just look at his record. If you want a true liberty-minded constitutionalist to go to Washington and actually defend your rights and the Constitution, I am your only choice on the ballot. But in order for that to happen, I need your support, whether with your time or money, and I ask for your vote in November. Find more on my website, fretsforcongress.com. Again, I'm Kalen Fretz. Thank you. Yes, sir. What are your views on permanence for a constitutionally elected official? I'm for them. Absolutely. Well, uh, I, I actually like the way Florida does it. Uh, for the House members, it's four terms, two years apiece. For the Senate, it's two terms and four years apiece. Obviously, that would be slightly different in the, in the Congress because the senators have six years. But uh, we definitely need to term limit Congress because those guys stay in there forever and, and, and get into the system. So, yes, sir. What are your local military connections? Well, as far as local connections, I, I, my brother is currently serving in Pakistan. So, uh, you know, I'm, I, I completely understand what, what the military is going through right now. And, uh, you know, we, we have to defend veterans. Unfortunately, our, our, our current congressman, like I said, portrays himself as a defender of veterans, but he votes for, for massive debt. And, uh, you know, our veterans are hurt like that just, by anybody, just like anybody else. Not to mention, if anybody's aware of the uh, issues with Camp Lejeune, there was uh, poison drinking water uh, a few decades ago that injured thousands of Marines and their families, even killed some of them, and uh, the government didn't compensate them for those injuries. And uh, this issue was obviously brought up to Jeff Miller, 
multiple times, and uh, he never acted on it. So if you want someone that's, that's really going to defend veterans, that's going to take real issues into Congress and bring them, bring them in front of the American people, I'm your guy. Any more questions? i got about 15 seconds here. Thank you very much. Again, press for Congress. Restore the Constitution.